Hey guys, Miss Eyes is back with Broken Sword the Sleeping Dragon. Alright, back on with this. We have arrived at a theatre where we need to investigate. There's a lead with this connecting to um, the, informa the information we got from um, Vernon's safe. And basically this theatre is the one lead we've got. So here we are. As Nico. The door was locked. I couldn't force it. Right. So how do we get around this? Well, to start with, we need to go round the back. So we need to go this way. And round here. The other side of the building. Well, look over there in the distance. Look what we got here. It was the Red Jaguar that had nearly run me over. The killer clearly had the connection to the theater. Aha! On the right track after all. Now we got somewhere. I could see the mask the traffic warden had described. I was in the right place, all right. Right then. Let's get busy. We need to get up here. So to do that, we need to go... Ah, here we are. Up we go. Okay, go up here. Then, we go this way. Then if we jump here, up here, Now we gotta bring this across now. That should be enough. Okay, maybe not. Hang on, one more will do. Maybe not. Uh, hang on. Okay, hang on. I gotta try and figure this out now. Get up there, Nico. Okay, just a little step. And up we go. The target is this here. The base of the billboard was attached by metal clips. <laughs> I had loosened the clips, but the billboard didn't budge. Yes, that's unfortunate. Because we also have to go upwards. We need to go and get it from the top as well. So let's go this way now. Jump across the gap. And then we gotta go this way. Okay, then go up here. Uh, do we go this way or is it the other way? No, we go the other way. We go upwards again. We go up here, as we do. Uh, then we go down. Very good. I think then we climb this. Okay, we're getting there. We're almost there. Okay, so we gotta go upwards. You can't get it from here. You gotta go upwards again. You can get it now from the top. It was a gamble, but my options were limited. So let's unstrap it, and down it goes! Right onto the theatre area. Success. And now, because of that, I've got to literally go back down there, right to where that is. Which is in the first part that I just took down. So, let's go back that way. Uh, this way. Can't remember the route now. It's not that difficult, mind you. This is pretty simple. Then we go this way. And down again. 
And this way. Now, if I remember, we jump. Yes, we do. Come on. Very good. Then we go up here. And then we go up here. And here we are. This is where we want to be. Oh, come on. There. That's what I wanted. Now we can go over there. I was risking death with every step. But so what? I felt like I was under a death sentence already. Considering what you're walking into. And how psychotic that woman is. Oh dear. Well that screwed you. So yeah, we've arrived on the theatre rooftop. Now we actually gotta get in there. God, that was close. I was trapped on the theatre side with no way back. Right, so what we wanna do now. Yeah, I think we go up here, don't we? Yeah, we go up here. Go this way. And in through here. Or maybe not. Just another locked door. Okay, that's no good. Um Going this way, do we? Just another locked door. Not there. Uh, oh, wait, 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 wait. I see it. We gotta go down here. The ladder that's sticking out just slightly. Then we can get in via this way. Oh, that took a bit of doing, but we made it. So now we're inside the theatre. And you know, considering the car was there, I got a feeling the killer is in this building. And I think we want to be wary of that because remember what happened when we saw her before? She really wanted to kill us. We got out of it by the fact her gun stalled. Okay, here we go. Oh, blimey. Whoa, this place looks weird. Jeez. Okay, go down here. Spooky. Then we go in here. Okay, then. There was somebody coming. I had to hide. The popcorn stand was my only option. I shall miss Paris, my dear. Suzaro! Charming, has it not? I shall never forget it. And the killer. But Wait, is that? Unstable. And we have no need of this base. When will we leave? That guy back there? We know him. Are working out perfectly. No, of course. That, Nico, was so typical of you, wasn't it? Yeah. And he gra she, you get grabbed again. It seems that we have a visitor. Is this the right place for the audition? You again. Aha, so this is the girl. Petra, my dear. Help! Nico Collard, Senor Suzaro. We have never met, and yet our lives have crossed. For the worst. In your case, that will certainly be true. Flap! Yep, that's Flap! Remember in the first game there was that really big idiot guy who was working for the Neo Templars? Yeah, this is that same guy. And considering Suzaro is in fact um, 
like we've learned the so-called Grandmaster of the Cult of the Dragon. Yeah, flat works for him. And now it seems the killer, Petra as she's called, is also part of the Cult of the Dragon. So, Bruno and I came to Paris. It was the first time I've been back since, well, since the last time. I was on the trail of Cesaro and the Dragon Power. We waited till it got dark. Then Bruno led me through the back streets to the place he suspected. Uh, what? I waited while he checked the readings on his mysterious device. My calculations indicate that this is the place. Behind that wall? Are you sure? My machine tells me it is there and I have no reason to doubt it. Okay. Well, let's get inside and take a look. No! I am not going in there. I said I would bring you here, and that is what I have done. I am not going in there. Jeez, oh, come on, it's not. No. It well, there's only a massive serial pot killer in there. Okay, Bruno, you stay here. All right, you insist. We're going in there. This could be bad. Now, where are we? If I go this way. Huh, hang on. If I remember. Okay, grab this. Okay. You want... oh, yeah, I can't exam you can't examine the trash bins here. Go this way. Right, what you wanna do, you might it might be hard to see due to the darkness. I'll try and explain. You need to push the block all the way over to the far right. Once it's as far as it'll go, push it upwards. Okay, it's at the far end, then jump on top, and then you can close this lid on the uh, rubbish um, lid. Right, now we can climb on top of it. That allow us to get into this Someone building. Was very scared of what lay ahead. It's a window, by the way. Very hard ah. to see in this darkness, but it is a the window. window opened easily. I told you so. I found myself in a book repository. Ah, oh, right, yeah. Now, this is where things are going to get pretty difficult, because, I kid you not, there's no freaking light here! Okay, there's a door here we can get out of, that's terrific. Now, you, you think you guys are having trouble with this? I'm having trouble figuring out where I'm going as well! Oh, hang on. If I remember correctly, if I go this way... Where's... <sighs> Okay, this way and examine. Books on the occult and the paranormal. Hmm. Sacrifice made easy. 101 ways to kill a goat. The perfect Christmas gift. Yeah, George has got a real issue with goats. He really doesn't like them. Right. Here's the next step. We need to get... Um, I think we got to move that. So what we got to do... First, we gotta pull, we gotta push that, okay. Go up. Uh, no, that's not right. Is there another block in here? Oh, there is, isn't there? It's right over there. Now, which is, how do I get over here? Answer? Like this. It's not easy to see, I know. Fibbing thing is absolutely annoying to look at. The fact you can barely make out what I'm doing. So I'm just getting this box over here and I'm trying to get it into position. Okay, you can not really see the flipping box now. Darn it, not enough. Okay, hang on, let's push it some more. 
Is that enough now? Can I push it this way now? Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Then I push this one. Oh, you're going the wrong way, dude. Ah. Oh. Okay, seriously now. One more. Okay, that's it. That's what we wanted. Now we can pull this. That's what I'm looking for. Let there be lights. The room was just a storeroom. Okay, so technically this was something that was pretty useless, but I can't quite remember what we do. Uh, okay. Let's get out of here. Unfortunately, that was only for that room. It doesn't turn the lights on anywhere else. Go figure. There's a filing cabinet. So they are of no use to us. File cabinet again. I know that. Uh. Oh, Jesus is ridiculous. Barely make. Oh, what the fip is going on. I keep bumping into walls all the time. That door wasn't going to open. Well, that's typical, isn't it? I'll go back in here for now. There's got to be a way to turn the power on. Nothing happened. Right. That's typical, isn't it? Now, that wasn't quite right. Uh, got to be a way to turn the power back on. I, I, oh no, I don't think I do that actually. Pretty sure that's not what I do. The drawers weren't going to budge. Okay, fair enough. I think what I need is in fact in the storeroom. I turned the light on here, didn't I? Uh huh. Um, I'm trying to remember what I do. Don't do anything there, I know. Don't think there's anything in here, actually, now I say that. Not sure what that was about. Darn this blooming light. Can't make out what I'm doing. It's so dark, it's absolutely awful here. Right, so we don't go that way. Okay, come on, George. You can do it. Right, that door's locked. I know that. I think we go back in here now. Because there's got to be some way of turning this light on. Um... Don't think... Nope, that wouldn't work here. Huh. Ugh. I hoped to find something useful, but I was out of luck. Go figure. I know there's something I ought to do, I just can't remember what it was. Ugh. You don't go back out there. I know that. It was a light switch. Yeah, but the power's off, so... I thought about it, but decided not to do it. Okay. That is no good to us. Alright, let's try and find another way to get somewhere. Uh-huh. I know the file cabinets are no good. 
Okay, seriously, what we're doing must be in the storeroom. Huh. You see, the camera points this way. I wonder if... Wait! Ah! I remember. I've seen it. I can see it below. You guys might not be able to see it. There is something here we need. You gotta push this. Push it in. Stand here. Pull this across to get out of the way. Then we wanna pull this. And underneath this is a trap door. I could see a trap door. But to get to it, I was gonna have to move the box. Okay, there you go. It's out of the way now. The trap door was set flush into the floor. Down we go for a trap door. Where is it gonna lead us? Dare I ask, where is it gonna go? Oh boy, we're going to encounter something. Yeah, the loading on this is taking a while again. No surprise there. A ladder led down into a well-lit passage. It looked like Bruno could be right. This looks pretty darn creepy, actually, now that I say that. Look at this place. Hello, what have we got here? A ladder. Where does it lead? A boiler room? Okay. The old theatres. We're in the theatre again. Hey, they got a show. It was some kind of a rehearsal. As a one-time director of the Idaho Players, I was no stranger to the thespian arts. Oh, Where come on, it? George. We must have the location. I tell you, I don't know. <sighs> ah. George really doesn't notice any of this? Let me do this properly. Uh, George, seriously, popcorn. I know I can break her. As you wish, Petra. I'm not scared of you. You bunch of thugs. Bravo. <laughs> oh boy. And uh, George, how old is Ooh. that popcorn? Senior Cicero, sir. Sorry to bother you. Yes, what is it now? Flaps here. We got a little problem downstairs. To be precise, Flap, what kind of a problem? An intruder problem. A guy's getting killed problem. That's no good. Just as I was getting comfortable. Cesaro, this was no rehearsal. About time he figured it out. The performance was my old friend Nico. This is very tiresome. You will stay here, Miss Collard. Don't try anything. Some hope. What do you think I'm going to do? Ask the audience for help? You'd be surprised. Flap, you watch her like a hawk. Like a hawk, Senor Cicero. The name is Suzaro. Senor Suzaro. Do try and make an effort, Flap, or I shall have to kill you too. It seems that's one of Suzaro's favorite things to do. Kill people. And I think Petra's got the same idea. Same idea. They're both absolutely crazy. Yeah, go figure. Anyway, guys, uh, be honest, I'm going to stop the video here. We have managed to get to this point in the theater with George. Now he's got to go and rescue Nico and basically work together to find out what the heck those two and three actually are hiding in this place. 
And we gotta get by flat to get to Nico. So that's something else we gotta do. So thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys next video.